up, guys? Hey, man, it's trucking for you. It's trucking for you. Speaking to you. Are you lazy at home? Do you like driving? Can you go weeks and weeks and weeks without going home and seeing your family? Can you eat inside your truck and eat and uh, sleep inside this truck? Now that this video may ruffle some feathers. It may make a lot of people a little uneasy may not like what I'm about to say, but it's the truth. The truth hurts. Now, is trucking for you? I don't know. You gotta determine that. You can't, you can't keep asking people, is trucking for me? Should I be doing this? I don't know about, you have to know about your lifestyle. You gotta know about your inner half. You gotta know about this is a lifestyle out here. This isn't no, let me do nine to five and go home. You can ask, you can go to your local truck stop. It don't matter if he's an older person or a younger person. One day out here. You want to know the experience. Now, not the money. The experience. How is the experience out here? Not talking money, that's a whole different subject. I'm talking about the experience. Because if you don't enjoy the experience out here, you're gonna leave. Money or not, you're going to leave. Now, I've been out here for almost five years. It'll be five years in August. Ups and downs. Different opinions. You have to understand that you are a licensed professional driver. The same thing that you did in your car, you can't do the same things that you cannot do in this truck. You get mad, you cut somebody off. You do, that, you do that in this truck, manslaughter, go to prison. If you didn't like traffic in your regular car, what makes you think that you are gonna like traffic in this car? Not saying that you're supposed to like traffic or things like that. You just gotta know that this is your job. You're going to see traffic every day. And I'm taking this very, very serious. Because a lot of people come out here and they see the big trucks, they see the glamour, and they see the air brakes, and they see all these certain things. They want to see the world, and there's nothing wrong with that. But the lifestyle that you're about to change to is totally different. The eating habits, the workout habits, the physical damage that it does to your body if you don't get up and walk and get around. You have to eat good out here. I'm t I'm, I'm t I don't care. If you're the skinniest person, just because you're skinny in the outside doesn't mean your insides are good. Does not mean that your insides are good. Can I tell you one thing? A bigger person's insides could be better than a skinny person's insides. Just because the outside don't look all that great, all right, cool. It's about the inside. What is going on inside that you cannot see? You gotta be humble out here, patient. 
That's my biggest thing. Humble and being patient. Not, you know, not getting mad. If you're an angry person, hint, hint, I'm angry no more, but I can get that way. But if you're an angry person and just hate everybody and everything around you, this ain't for you. You're going to see different people on a daily basis. White, black, Puerto Rican, whatever it is. If you don't like the other color, don't put it in public. Don't come out here then. There's all kind of different races out here and we don't need somebody out here hating somebody else because of the color of their skin. Dislike, all right, cool, but hate somebody and want to do harm to that person, don't need it out here. Can you sleep in that bed back though? If you team it, can you sleep while the truck is moving? Can you take a shower every two days, every day and a half? Can you go to the bathroom in a public restroom? Because one thing, you're not gonna be stopping at a hotel every night. OTR, even regional. So I ask you, it's trucking for you. And there's a lot more things that I didn't talk about. But if you can think about some other things, leave them in the description or leave them in the comments below. Trucking ain't easy. Yes, the money's there, but you gotta work towards that. your experience and your lifestyle that's going to determine if you stay out here because if your experience is good and the money is okay you, you know you'll stay out here now you, you ain't going to be no millionaire out here now your first couple years But you'll be comfortable. And I ain't talking about money. I didn't. Not gonna, I'm not talking about money. Okay? When you're teaming with somebody, when you're with your trainer, can you live with that person? Can you agree to disagree? Can you shut your mouth sometimes? Can, can you humble yourself? Turn on the cheek. Today's going to be a great day. That's why I tell myself now, no matter what, today is a great day. You have to know why you come out here each and every day. And it's almost 10 minutes, so I want to waste a lot of your time. You have to know why you want to come out here. What are you working towards? Are you out here for your family? Are you out here to build your business? Are you out here to see the world? Are you out here just to see how it is? And then go back home and do something local. That's fine. But you have to know why you're out here. Nobody else can tell you why you're out here or why do you want to come out here. All right? So I ask you again, this truck is for you. In the comments below, man, let me know where you're at in, in your career.
of trucking now. Where are you at? Are you first coming to the game? Are you training right now? Are you 10 years in the game, 20 years in the game? How do you like it? Maybe that can help somebody out. All right? Always remember, guys, why not? Why not be different? Life is brief. Remember that.